Hi everyone, this is Jay Singh from Technic Solutions and um, in this video we are going to look at software requirements for SCCM current branch. So the current branch is 1802. Uh, once we install 1802 then we have that option to update it to 1806. And in the last video we had a look at SCCM fundamentals. If you have not checked that video, have a look at that video, link is given in the description. It is very important to know fundamentals of SCCM. So let's have a look at what are the software requirements and all links are given in the description so you can go on these links and download the required software. And um, also I would like to mention that most of the software we are going to use are evaluation software so you do not have to pay anything for those ones. So the very first one you need Windows Server 2016 and you can download ISO file and um, then you can save it. So we will create we will be creating few virtual machines and for that you need this ISO file to create Windows Server 2016. And the next one is SCCM itself. So we will be downloading System Sensor Configuration Manager with endpoint protection. Current branch 1802. Fill in these details and continue and download and uh, this will be a zip file so you have to unzip the um, SCCM files and after that we need SQL Server 2016 Service Pack 2 so for every single SCCM version there are supported SQL Server options if you go to the link given in the description so you can see what are the uh, supported versions of SQL Server for current branch which is 1802 okay you can download SQL Server 2017 but you need cumulative update version 2 with that so I am using SQL Server 2016 Service Pack 2 uh, it will be enterprise and um, that version is evaluation and the next software is ADK uh, at the moment we need 1803 so go to the link and download ADK 1803 so what you want to do is click on that link it will download exe file run the file and then you have to have the option to download offline files so just save the offline files I can quickly demonstrate that alright so I click on the download link I got this uh, ADK setup exe file I'm going to run this file I have these options I'm gonna select download click continue and this is the path where it's going to download and you click download. So the next thing you need SSMS which is SQL Server Management Studio current version is 17.9 click on the link given in the description and download that file as well. Apart from this you, there are some prerequisites and we'll have a look at these prerequisites later and um, let's have a quick look at those ones so a few of them are like .NET um, these are the options Apart from that, BITS, IAS, RDC, uh, these ones are bundled in the Windows Server 2016 ISO file and we are going to use these roles once we have our domain controller and our SCCM server installed. Apart from this, one thing I would like to mention is you need SCCM update files. Okay, and these update files can be downloaded as well so you can download those update files beforehand I'll quickly show you how you can do that so once you download SCCM files unzip them once you unzip them you'll see something like this so double click on that and SMS setup double click on that in bin x64 search for setup DL so there's an XC file setup DL double click on that and just pick a path so for example C drive test and click on download or you can browse to the path as well if the test folder is not there so click on download it's gonna download all the files um, copy over this f uh, folder like I did so I put in SCCM downloads I got my SCCM um, files SCCM update files Windows kits um, SQL Server, SSMS and Windows Server 2016. So download those files in the next video we will discuss about lab setup after that we'll start setting up our test lab.
thank you for watching give this video a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe my channel if you have not done yet see you in the next video